Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Captain Radar. Today we're going to be working on this machine ba behind me, the Mac Pro 2009 that has been flashed to be a 5 comma 1. So what I'm going to be doing to it is ripping out the rust bucket that's in there, the hard drive, transferring what's on that hard drive to a SSD that I put in, well, to, I shouldn't have put it in there, to this SSD, so I have faster boot times and, you know, all that fast, fast stuff, and we're going to be trying this GPU in with it, which is the NVIDIA Quadro K600, because f from all the research that I've done, it is supported natively with Mac OS. So hopefully that fixes all the problems that I have with the GT120. So yeah, let's uh let's get into it. I am going to open this up, throw this card in here. You'll probably maybe get footage from this. Who knows? Depends on whatever. Uh call it Wi-Fi and Bluetooth card because it's not supported in Monterey which is the OS I'm using so I know I said I was doing an SSD but I need the GPU first before I put in the SSD so we're gonna do that and then all the other stuff so let's close this up we're gonna jump back over to the desk Plug this in, see if it all boots, if there are any magical beeps or whatever, and yeah, we'll, we'll go from there. Alright, so, we have it plugged back in. I'm going to boot it up for the first time with the new RAM and the second graphics card. And let's see what happens. I hear bong. Oh, okay. So, looking at it, that's not a good sign. It flashing light so I'm gonna troubleshoot this and be right back so uh, I pulled it over to the bench because maybe the TV doesn't like whatever so I pulled it over to my bench we're gonna power it back on and see what happens well I'm gonna plug patch it in or plug it in whatever you want to say <clears throat> yeah. Oh, come on, power cord. Yeah, plug that in. Turn that monitor on, which it should be on. It, sh it is. It should be on digital input. Press that power button.
Well, I got a bong and the lot and the display turned on. What I really should do is plug it into this TV as well. But I don't have. Oh wait, yeah, I do I have the technology? Uh you know what? I'm gonna do that. Well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to let it sit here for a little bit. I'm going to turn the camera off and come back and see what the conclusion is going to be. Because it may just be a RAM and a RAM and SSD upgrade for this for now. So, yeah, well, stay tuned. So. It's been a couple of days since I've recorded those clips. Uh, as you see, I've gotten the Mac Pro to work. It's still with the original graphics card or GPU. I was unsuccessful with getting the NVIDIA Quadro K600 working. Also, I was unsuccessful getting the uh, Radeon... 45 right yeah 4550 working which i tried that off camera because a i forgot to record it and b i forgot to record it um but i have the ssd working in but it i remembered because i had a friend that did it the optical bays have standard sata like sata power and data in it so all i did was plug in the ssd to that and it works perfectly fine. Granted, I know it's a SATA 2 bus. But it works for right now. Uh, there will be more upgrades to it in the future. So, yeah. There may be an NVMe in the future. You never know. So, I want to thank you very much for watching. Uh, remember to subscribe, like, and leave a comment if you feel so inclined to. And I will see you in the next one.